Hello and welcome to NetDoomer's Connection Optimization Guide for Valorant. In this video, we will be showing you how Duma OS 4 on the NetDoomer R3 gaming router can completely optimize your connection in Valorant. If you want to climb the ranks to Radiant, a fast and stable connection is crucial to get pinpoint accuracy and fluid movement. Duma OS has a range of powerful features that will prioritize your gaming traffic, connect you to the best low ping servers, and stabilize your connection by removing jitter. Whether you're suffering from network problems like high ping, ping spikes, or packet loss, we'll be showing you how to fix them all in this video. So let's get started. Firstly, let's get gaming traffic prioritized on your network. We can do this using the Smart Boost feature. I'm sure you know what it's like gaming on a busy network. You've got people streaming 4K video, downloading files and scrolling on TikTok, and it's all making you lag in Valorant. Smart Boost solves this by ensuring your gaming always gets the optimal amount of bandwidth for the best performance. So even when you have a busy network full of bandwidth intensive activities, they won't affect your gameplay. To set up Smart Boost, all you need to do is have gaming on your priority list and move it to the top priority slot. It really is as simple as that. Now you won't have high ping and packet loss when your roommate starts binging Netflix. Now gaming traffic is the top priority on your network, let's start optimizing your connection in Valorant. You can already select the low ping servers you want to play on by hovering over the connection icon before searching for a game. Geofilter does the same thing, but with the added benefit of steady ping. This new Duma OS 4 feature completely stabilizes your connection by removing jitter. This gives you insanely smooth and responsive gameplay, which is ideal for clicking heads with the Vandal. To be able to use steady ping to stabilize your connection, you need to add your PC and Valorant to Geofilter. You can then use Geofilter to control what servers you play on in conjunction with the in-game setting or you can just use it for the steady ping benefits. Now Valorant is added to Geofilter. When you get into a game, you can see the server information and the ping graph in the side panel. We'll go through what this all means shortly. Duma OS 4 is now set up to give us the best connection in Valorant. Let's see it working in game. We've just connected and loaded into a game. If we take a look at Duma OS, you can see we have connected to a server within our filter radius, which means we'll be playing on a low ping. You can also see our connection being stabilized in the side menu. The bottom line of the graph shows what your ping would usually be without steady ping. As you can see, it's constantly moving up and down. These constant changes can lead to lag compensation or make your shots feel off. This is because the game server has a harder time processing your inputs when there's jitter in your connection. The top line of the graph shows your new and stabilized ping. Steady ping applies a buffer to your ping, which will increase it slightly. It does this so it can account for any jitter, which results in a stable ping value. If we take a look in-game, with the network statistics turned on, we can see how responsive the gameplay is with this connection. It's worth saying the ping value in-game will differ slightly from the values in Duma OS. This is because the game calculates ping with a weighted average. Now let's test our connection when the network becomes busy. If we open Netflix to stream 4K video, Steam to start a download and start scrolling on TikTok, we can see their traffic start to appear in Smart Boost. As gaming is the top priority, Smart Boost will prioritize the gaming traffic above all of the other activities, as we can see here. If we go back into the game, we can see our connection is still fast and more importantly stable, all thanks to Smart Boost. So there you have it, a great connection in Valorant. You can see just how effective Duma OS 4 is at optimizing your connection even when playing on a busy network. If you want to get your hands on Duma OS 4, check out the NetDuma R3 gaming router on our website, linked in the description below. If you've got any questions about the R3 or the features shown in this video, drop a comment and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Thanks for watching, we'll see you in the next one.